Hey guys, welcome to another episode of the Cryptic Commander on YouTube. Today we're going to do a draft, if you can hear me with all these fans going in this room. <laughs> Brought over some family and friends. I got my wife, Chris. I got my friend Matt, Critter. <laughs> I got Vicky. Hi. Let me get rip open the box here. We're going to do a simple draft, so you can buy booster packs and you can do, uh, you know, build decks. You can really do whatever you want with booster packs. And then this is another thing you can do. You can draft. So I got some friends together. I like to use the base of my draft or on like a, a little deck afterwards, normally. Yeah, absolutely. For sure. We're going to build decks with these. Everybody gets three packs. You guys have done this before. You're no stranger. And uh, the thing about this set is to remind the viewers and uh, people playing here that there's going to be a, a planeswalker in every pack. The, uh, open so, this one. Yeah, you can open it because we're going to open it okay. sim simultaneously right now. We're going to go ahead and open it. We're no stranger. There's going to be a token card in the basic land. Keep the basic land in there and throw the token out. We're only going to make one stack in front of us, not four stacks or something like that. One stack in front of us. And then we're going to pass um, after picking one card. We're going to pass the rest of the stack left until all that stack is gone. Let's see what we got here. Um, yeah, I'll take that one, I guess. That's good. Pass that all left. Just one stack in front of you guys because we want to show the viewers, the ones that even don't know how to do this, how to do this. And this is just simply a draft. We're going to build a 45 card deck because if you do the math there's 15 cards in each booster and um, times three is 45 and we should all end up with 45 cards kind of sort of hand chosen let's build our own deck now vicky when was the last time you drafted uh probably about a month ago a month ago what about you craig uh it's been more like few months. A few months? Well, when was the last pre-release? Almost, almost a year, but... The last pre-release? Yeah. Um... That's in the left, right? Yes. Yeah, it's the yeah. Um, I don't remember when the last pre-release was. Well, that was the last time I drafted. <laughs> uh, stores were closed, obviously, so... Right. We couldn't physically go anywhere to draft, um, or do pre-release, so we just bought pre-release kits and drafted at home. Make the best of the worst situation. Right. I thought it'd be really cool to, you know, put it on the YouTube. You know, there's going to be people out there that you know, probably enjoy watching the draft or even don't even know what draft is, so I'm sure it's gonna be a learning experience for someone out there. I know, right now I'm trying to go through and get, you know, good cards for, for the deck that I'm gonna to use to try to play you guys. Right. All right. And if anybody has any like questions or they can leave a comment and we'll get back to them with an answer. It's really easy once you get into it, but it's more of a hands on thing. We could explain it all day long, but unless you actually physically see it and do it, it's sometimes a hard concept to grasp. Dog underneath me here. <laughs> so I'm sure all weird like. Dogs being quiet. It's kind of quiet. Little bit more concentrating.
I love the flavor text on this card. Mm. Is that how you're drafting tonight? By the flavor text? Yeah. Purely by fa flavor text. <laughs> <laughs> right. Hey, that sounds dope. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. It's not. When I when I draft, I try I try to uh, draft for colors, certain colors that I like. I'll see something that's you know strong or whatever when I'm drafting, and I'll try to go with that. You know what I mean? And sorry, I'm just over there being quiet reading cards. You're just ready to bust the next pack open, that's all. You betcha. Christmas morning. That's, that's the best part about our thing is so, ripping open the packs, seeing what you got. Okay, so I, I use these to make up the, the decks I make. Shortly thereafter, you know, find cool stuff that you don't aren't used to seeing because you're getting new cards. And then take some of the old cards that I got and put them in that and make a little deck that I really like. I have so many decks, and some of them are partial because I never really got them finished. That's the problem is sometimes there's, actually there's a meme going around. It says, I started sorting my cards. I ended up starting four new decks. Right. Because <laughs> that's really literally what happens. You'll go through your collection that you've amassed and start putting things together that you want to see work, but, you know, combos. And sometimes we have one of each card almost. Really tokens? Yes. Two black and red. And this is the green and white. Yes. But we have a zombie and a zombie army. This one's my pick. That'll do. That'll do, pig. <laughs> I don't do donkey. I don't do. Movie references. Mm -hmm. Can you name the movie? <laughs> I don't do donkey or shrimp. I don't do donkey or pig. I wasn't sure. Babe. I haven't seen the babe in so long. Yeah. Uh, oldie but a goodie. I was watching uh, Charlotte's Web the other day. Oh, I that was one of my one. favorites when I was a kid. I know that much. <laughs> now we're just starting to keep track of them by the yeah. Oh man, this is the best card I got all night. Alright, so you guys oh, can yeah. preview if you want for a couple seconds with what you already yeah, got. Yeah, I, I looked at one in the beginning. Yeah, you can look at what you got already, basically. Alright, so now you can open this pack, take out your token, yeah. and then pass them right this time. Draft with Lauren Smith. 
three, uh, after that last, uh, what was the, not the zombie armies. Yes, they were big in this, though. When I got my pre-release packs, the cards were out of order. All the, like, mythics and rares and all that were in the front. It was really weird. To the left. No, it's to the right. I just moved it this way. Right. No, it's to the left this time. No, we oh, went to the right. We just did to the left. It's, to the right it's okay. Time. You're right, it's to the right. That happens a lot. People get confused, so you gotta, like, we start watch left. out for other people yeah. and try to help each other. It's the only way the game goes right for real. Drafting is really a skill that will help you better yourself as a magic player. It, it lets you easily put together card combinations, like, once you do it more often. It, it helped my game, like, tenfold. And literally, I used to try to build a deck, and I would just throw random things together, and couldn't figure out why it wasn't working. And once I started drafting, I started getting more used to the cards and the mechanics and what went well together. This is almost identical to the last pack. Well, they are the same packs. It's where it's parked. No, no, no. made me think. draft to uh, win and some people just draft to get the good cards out of the first few packs. Yeah. That is very true. And a good thing to remember is creatures and spells are equally important because you need to have a good balance because you have to be ready for situations when you actually are playing or you have to take away somebody's creature or if you don't have enough creatures then you are open to any attack unless you have a blue control deck that doesn't let them do anything. mid-game. Don't know which way I'm going. Mm -hmm. You're done? Okay. I'm not. 
I'm trying to uh, figure out what I'm going to do here. I'm not going in two directions, but I'm still lost. Somebody is in my colors. Uh oh. Somebody snatching you with colors. Watching you. Was it? There's five colors, right? Yeah, it's on the back of every card. And then there's colorless. There's colorless, yeah. Is that the color that you're in? No, I'm just saying. There's I don't think there's nothing and, in this set to go and colorless. There's five, but everyone forgets about you. Know, I could be plucking them all for you. Even the packs I opened? Yeah. <laughs> From what I've heard, change is a pretty good plucker. Heard. Plucky pluck. He's a pluck. Never mind. <laughs> he's been plucking. Yeah, I'm gonna so, go back and play magic. So far. <laughs> Thank you. I don't want none of this. Well, you got another pack, so. Saving grace. You guys get the good, you'll just get the good stuff out of the last bag. Okay. Fine. Whatever. Yeah, sometimes you hate, sometimes you just get something you want. Yeah. Christmas number three. This is going Almost. to be the last pack here. Right here you go. All right. okay, oh so man. Remember to take out your token and then pass it left. Go ahead. Token and pass left. There's a token. There's a white token. Fine. There you go. I gave you a white. Zombie army. Ew. To the left, to the left. Maybe you in the box that way. I have to figure out what I'm going to do. Well, as soon as this pack gets exhausted, you know, exhausted, then I'm going to pause the video. But it's going to seem like I walk up and then walk and sit back down. It's going to be like pause and then we put our basic lands in here. Because I got a box of basic land over there. And then we'll build our decks and then we'll come back to the viewers. They'll just be like, it'll be like that for them. but. We're going to pause the video in a second.
I'm ready. Jews, huh? Sometimes. Yeah. Why not? Yeah, I'm not too good at thinking sometimes. It's a, you'll be all right. You don't see no smoke, do you? No, no, no. no. Oh, good. That happened a couple of times. And it doesn't snow up. Yeah, that's what I was saying. I didn't smell anything, so I assume you're good. So many times you can build a perfect deck. And they play nice. And then there's other times where they... Uh, <laughs> you get no mana. You get all your mana. You will get none of the cards you need in the right order. It's just all about the shuffle. Yes. Strategy. Do the watch of the draw. <laughs> Picking an opening Percent hand Percentages. <laughs> Life ain't nothing but a number. He kind of was a very black heavy set. Well, black was more powerful in this set, from what I saw. Then again, I didn't get to see a lot of red out of this set. There was a lot of it there. I haven't seen any of this set, except for what we've... I've seen a whole box of this set. Well, I saw it yesterday, but I didn't get to read the cards per se, except for the rares and the um, planeswalkers. Mana is your friend. particular token reminds me of Doctor Strange, but it does. It's a pretty token. I like the prismatic. Yeah. Looking back. You can take all of that. I don't even see that pack again. Oh, it'll come around to you again. Uh, I know. Here it Not comes. looking forward to it. <laughs> it's like the monkeys, you know? 
Yeah. Hey, hey, hey we're the monkeys. Tired of the monkeys. I don't know how the song goes. It's been nope. a lot of time. Don't don't sue me if I got the words wrong. Yeah, I'm not gonna try to correct you if I'm. Yeah. I love. I them, don't think I'm. But it's that been old. many years. Well, I'm the old dog at the table, so. Yeah, you can use as many as you want, because if you got like 10 of one card in this draft format, you can use those 10 cards. Really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. The max score doesn't apply? The max score doesn't apply in a draft, right. I forgot about that. Yeah. I don't think there was any card in here that I picked that I saw enough of that I wanted that many. I did. There was a couple. I sure did take as many of them as I could. Very good card. I know you took one card that was mad about. What? Uh, Gaia is something, I can't remember. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah. Yeah, that was mad. Herald of the Dreadhorn. Every time I had a chance to get that one, that's what I got. Damn. So, I, I just totally hated that on one that one. I just totally hated that one. I that one. You stuck with that one. Got it. Okay, so we're going to pause the video right here. We're going to put some basic lands in there. We're going to build our decks, and we'll be right back. But to you guys, it's going to be like that. All right, welcome back, everybody. So we've already put our basic lands in the decks, and it looks like Chris and Critter are going to face each other. It's going to be a best-of-one match, and they've already decided they're opening hands. They both did not mulligan. Chris is on the play. Go ahead, guys. Um. Two-handed, so I do not draw. Right. Go ahead. Okay. Go ahead. Shriek Diaper. It's a 2 1 flyer. Gains haste until end of turn if I pump it. Go ahead. Go, girl. Stealth mission. I get two plus one plus one counters on target creature you control. That creature cannot be blocked this turn. I'll hit you for four flying. Change which menace? Menace means they cannot block unless it's with two or more creatures. So that creature has to be blocked by two creatures. That creature has to be blocked by at least two creatures or more. Not a bad mechanic. 
If used right, it can be deadly. Yeah. Or if you can yes. just keep one Mine creature on your bone side. Really permanent? Yeah. I played the stuff machine. That's pretty neat. Flying four so early in the game. <laughs> Some magic games are over very quickly. Yeah, this is gonna be a Some draw out for too. hours. Well we try not to. Well, me and him were playing Commander the other day and literally well, that's it a got much bigger deck than Yes, but I mean still in a two person setting they and with all the powerful cards that are usually in a commander deck. It should have been over a lot sooner. We were just both wiping the board. It was just we kept wiping the board and wiping the board and wiping the board. So it was like starting over from the plane board. Square one. So she gave blockers, right? Three, two. Okay, 17. Finished. Good, minus two. Oh. That puts a creature into play. This is two plus one counters. Any army you control it. if you don't so, control one. Oh. Yeah, you do. Go ahead. It's a 2 2 creature right now. No, I, don't have to, I don't have to get to this one, right? No, this, this is, is an army right here. This is an army, yeah. Well, yeah. we have the army card. Cool. Yeah, there's you the got army, an army card. Two, two. Yeah. yeah. There's the army card. There's your army. Right. Two. Two, two. Yep, that's 2 2. And every time you, you do, um, what's the word called? Proliferate. Proliferate is another one, too. Amass. Amass. You can amass and put more on there and make it bigger. And you do. Okay, you hit me for three, I took it. Yeah, a mass is a thing in this Menace, and I get to put a plus one plus one counter on a creature, and I will fly at your plane walk. And it's your turn. Beginning players would really know about that redirecting. Yeah, it's easy to explain. Yeah. We can talk about it in the podcast, even, you know, it's really easy to explain. You know, because so that was just an example of it where she attacked, instead of attacking him directly, she redirected the damage to his planeswalker. It's she, you can choose to attack the planeswalker or the player. It's really, I mean, it's not a thing you would redirect. Yeah, you want to get technical about it, is, but. Well, I mean, you isn't that how you're supposed to do it in a professional film? Yeah, yeah, this is That's this is kitchen table yeah. magic, yeah, so. I, no, I was but correct, yes, yeah, so you are supposed to read your own damage. Stuff. Six, That's seven, flying. I'm taking it. This is your black counter. Yeah, I'm not seeing it. Nice. Alright, your turn.
Y to 12. Total four, five, six, seven, nine. Um, Everything has trample. Or just when it enters the it just when it enters the battlefield. Yeah, this one has trample. Right. This is just a two two, and, and this is a three minus. two. Is this one the one with Oh, minus? I forgot to proliferate. No, the menaces are all gone, though. Oh, the menaces are all gone? I should have proliferated when the land came into play. Go ahead. Is that right? Yeah, go ahead. It's the only thing you can add a counter to, so yeah. yeah. Okay. I'll block this one. Find dies. So, three, seven. On a five. This card. And as breach, when this card enters the battlefield, if you control another creature with four or greater, it deals two damage to any, no, to each opponent. Right, you're an opponent, you take two, take two. So I'm three. I'm three. You tap this, sacrifice this dude right here, I guess, and it does four damage. Yeah, you killed you. Good game. Good game. Okay. You know. So that means Critter moves into the final round, and me and Vicky play right now. All right, Vicky, you ready? Yep. All right, let's go ahead and do it. Are you taking Critter's seat? We're going to take these seats, yeah. I, I was asking which one you're taking. It don't matter. I'll take that one over there. Okay. Yes. Little musical chair here. Okay. Here's your phone, okay, kind of, sir. Okay. So you want to roll to see who goes first? What are we rolling? It don't matter. What are we rolling? As long as it's a random die and not a spin. Okay. Six. And two. Good luck. Good Yeah. Yeah, I'll run with it. Is a minimum of 40 cards? Yeah, minimum of 40, yep. Yeah. It's a minimum of 40 cards, and then the most likely, 9 times out of 10, you're going to go with 17 land and 23 other cards. I call this Power Shuffle. Let me get them all mixed up. Okay, yeah, go ahead. It's called Pile Shuffle, technically. Yeah, Pile Shuffle. Yeah, good. Dreadlord Butcher. Um, he's got haste. Mm -hmm. Swing one. Okay. Yeah. Whenever it uh, deals combat damage to a player, put a one or a planeswalker, put a plus one counter on him. So I'll go ahead and do that. And then uh, when it dies, it deals damage equal to its power to any target. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Yeah. 
swing two. Black, I'm going to enchant this with uh, Kai's Ghost Form, you know the card, right? And then I'll pass. Go ahead. I'm going to play Mana Geo. Sure. Go ahead. Two damage to you? Mm -hmm. You're at 18. Oh, wait. You're at 18 minus. Some, right? Minus you took, I took two, so I was at 16. So what am I taking now? You took three. Plus no, because he got the counter after. When I hit you for one, he got a counter. Mm -hmm. And then when I hit you for two, he got another counter. Right, but so I took Just one and three. Two. One and then two. And then another two. So you're at 15. Yeah. No, that's what I'm saying. Right. With the damage, I didn't take right. three from him yet. Swing three. Now it is. Right. No, this was the beginning of your turn, but... Swing three, right? You're gonna take it, and this goes up one. I already took it. I know. Oh. <laughs> and then I will play this. This one will play tapped. Go ahead. Lazotep Behemoth. That's what that is. Lazotep Behemoth. It's a 5 4 hippo. I like my hippos. <laughs> He's hungry. What? 5 4 hippo. A 5 4 hippo. I don't know about all that. Hey, look, he's a hippo dog. He's, um, he's, he's getting the trap, I guess. From this guy? Okay. okay. Alright. It's good to have a big creature sometimes in draft, right? And, yeah. Uh, yeah, you, you want big creatures when you draft, for sure. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and play another big hippo. And then I'll tap this for black. Oh, wait, 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 wait. You stop this one, so I'll go ahead and swing for five. Divine arrow. What does it do? Kills it. Okay. It deals four damage to attacking or blocking the Sure. Um I'll pass. I'm trying to decide which one. Give me just a second, John. No, that one. Okay. Wait. Okay. And go. I'll kill that 
Rodriguez? Um, what? Oh, this. Just kill it. I pay five to kill it. Oh, okay. So we're destroying. I'll play Ash. I'm gonna sure. tap it. Yeah. I'm gonna turn this in my hand. Sounds good. I'll play Ashiot. I'll minus one from Ashiot. Go ahead, no four in an exile. I'll swing five it. Your point's Walker. Pass. Man was a genius, though, Freddie Mercury. Here we go. She's tapping. Okay. I'm going to kill your hippos. Okay. Yeah. Shows you for liking hippos. Okay, so three damage to you. Oh, wait. Target creature can't do that. Can't do that. So I'll go ahead minus one here. Mm -hmm. No four removal. And then I'll swing four at you. Okay. Yeah. Pass. In a turn, you had to kill your creature, is that right? Where? We need, we need to play that card. Yeah. If I would, if I would, I gotta do three damage to target creature. What is it, a 1 5? Mm -hmm. Okay. What is this? 5 5? Five? 5 5. Three damage to it, and I'll scrag one. Go ahead. This dude's got haste. He's a four of one. And when he dies, put a one one counter on target creature I control. Swing. Swing for a one. What? Yeah, put a one counter on this guy. I gained two life. Okay. No four and an exile. Go ahead. Done. I'm gonna play. Yeah. The rogue shadow. Mm -hmm. At the beginning of each opponent's upkeep, that player has one or fewer cards in hand. Um, two damage, right? Two damage. Yeah, yeah. And make it just a card. Right. Destroy that. 
Same thing, pay five for it. Yeah, you take your two damage? I'll take two damage. And then swing six six. Unlock? Sure. Mill four and then exile. Yeah, so this uh, spells and abilities you control can't make the search library. Okay. Nice. Yeah, I notice these new planeswalkers, they don't have no plus abilities. The so uncommon know. ones don't, yeah. I notice those weird. The rare ones do, and then the uh, mythic rare ones do. Thing like four, two damage. Three, three, four. Yeah, I'll take two damage, yeah. So it's uh, 16. Swing. Okay. Um, go ahead and mill four and exile. Put uh, two blast counters on it. Blast them away, yeah. Kill your creature. Okay. It's coming back in a play. Is it one one? Right. My go? It's each non land turn. Okay. Right. So, yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm going to swing with one. Okay. And plus two. Oh wait. Game. Sorry. Sure. I'm gonna kill it. Okay. Give me back one. Go ahead. Take your two damage? Yeah. Not looking good for me now. He's turned around. Uh, relentless advantage? Yep. I put uh, three one one counters on an army I control. There you go. Bang, bang. Anything else? Uh, swing one. Okay. There I go. Yep. Got a six. Go ahead. Two. Okay. You don't. You don't have to. Uh, no. Take it. It's a stagnant ability. Yeah, static ability for most of them. Yeah. All right. So now that means you two are going to play. You both get two packs, no matter what. 
And then the winner walks away with four, though. All right, you guys go ahead and get at it. All right, let's see if I can do this again. Last match, hopefully the viewers are still watching and we didn't drop anybody, you know? Huh? Maybe just like us, they want to see who's going to win this shin big. Stay All right, here we go. Stealing my armies? May the best <laughs> man win. No, well, I didn't mean it. Okay. No, I no, I was throwing right, you the dice bag because it fell off the table. Wait. You go back. So the winner, me. the winner of this match and the loser of this match. Oh yeah. Best of one. Here we go. Oh. Best of one. Best of one. Sorry, yeah. I gotta shuffle, people. You're good. No, I'm missing over the whole time. Take your time, shuffle. I'm not trying to hurry up. No, I feel like the judge over here is being pushy. No. <laughs> We're running out of time on the video. Um, didn't think it was gonna be this one, but we're having fun though. That's what matters. And for packs. <laughs> with packs. Four packs with packs. Is anybody mulligan? No. Oh, okay, no mulligans. Who's going first? Did you roll that side? He goes first. He goes first? Here we go. Yeah, yeah. The draw. Excited to see this. You see what happens? Hopefully, we don't run out of tape. Uh, well, I like that. I like that, but I don't like that. I don't like that. Did you sure turn quickly? Good. Oh, is that Red Bull kicking in now? <laughs> like, I would need like eight of it to kick in. <laughs> I usually drink three a night at work. So, yeah, nope. Go ahead. Two, three. Mm. Is that two, one, one, that two, one, two, one? I have a two, one, two, one, two. It's a cat. When it's my turn, it has first strike. My turn? Yeah. What up, buddy? Some trample, man. Yeah, trample through. One trample game. through. Yeah, I poked her in the eye. Good. The rest is going through. They got it perforated in the middle. Maybe so they're easier to open. I think so. Yeah. People were complaining. Too hard to open the blister packs. I'm getting blisters. Uh, go ahead. <clears throat> oh boy. It's like scissors. You need scissors to open the pack. Of yeah. Scissors. scissors to open the pack, yeah. Lillian. Lillian's a lot of Was it going to be Lillian or Spiri? That's it. <laughs> No, they look really pretty so far. Yeah. I have a 2 1 trample and a 2 3. Planeswalker. Planeswalker. Each creature with a plus one, one counter to tap and add any color mana and a minus one to put a one one counter on dark creature. That looks like it's good. Good. Uh, you got a minus one. Well, you want a minus one for a one one counter on that? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, you should. It's a kitchen table. Collusion. I'll help you too. <laughs> You gotta minus that down one though. Yeah, I forgot you need to tap for it. 
I'm going to steal you from him. No, it was, it's his turn. He was messing with his plane walker. No, he's basket your turn. Oh, okay. Now it is my turn. I'm going to play... Make sure the town... Does... Yeah, go ahead. Four three trample. Four three trample. So red green is called Grohl. Grohl? Grohl. Yeah. Well, I like Grohl. Grohl. Yeah, I like Grohl's. And Grills. And Grills. Those are nice too. Blue white's Azorius. I think she's got black in her to make it Esper. Uh, I'm going to swing three, four, five at you, and this gets a one, one counter, so technically six. One, oh no, So you're at 16, right? Yes. Yeah. Well, what I should for you, 16. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I attacked with two creatures. So he pumps up there? Yes, he's, that stays there. And he's going to stay there as long as I keep attacking with two creatures. Oh, okay, two other creatures. Okay.
go when it enters the battlefield, other creatures you control when you trample until you turn. But it's a 4 5, and if a 4 5 comes into play, you can go So it's a nice. Do you want I'll block the five, four, take four, five, six. At least trample. I know. to put two glass counters on this. And the list. What is it? It it does damage. Uh, it kills anything. Uh, I'm going to attack this and it's going to destroy each non-land permanent with a converted mana cost equal to the number of charge counters. So. Two, right? Two. Yeah. He's got one red lamp. So just you're at sixteen right now, she's at nine. Toward the end game right now. Toward the end game right now. This is all over in just a few seconds. One way or another, we're going to have a. And then we'll be like Cookie Monster on, uh, on, on packs, huh? Yeah. What do you say? Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. On packs. On packs. <laughs> oh. Yeah. C is for card and it's good enough for me. <laughs> you know they made them change the song? No, I didn't know that. Yep. Yeah. So now it's C is the sometimes food and that's good enough. Or something to that of that. Huh. I know. I know they took well Elmer Fudd's gun. Well, they tried to take away speed because that was 
comes and plays out. Looks like it's almost over. Block block that dies. Would you block this guy? No, this block dies. I'm blocking with my three, my four three, right okay. here. Oh, okay. Block dies, block dies. This one I'm blocking right here. Chump block. Chump block, because it only does four damage. It wouldn't trample. Yeah, yeah. Zero. You're still taking the yep. zero. And I'm taking five. Five. Three. Push you down to four. Mm -hmm. Sacrifice this guy. Okay. Put plus two on him. Okay. Down two. Go ahead and cast this. After that, plays out. Cast this as an addition to the cost. Sacrifice this creature right here. And for it. That's it. Critter wins. All right, guys, thanks for watching. We, didn't, we, we weren't sure how long that was going to last, but until next time. Mm -hmm.